In this video, we'll be talking about adding third-party VSTs to Mixcraft. Mixcraft comes with many included instruments and effects, but you may find new plugins online that you'd like to use in your productions. There are many VSTs available, both free and paid, which can add new effects, instruments, and capabilities to your production toolset. Mixcraft supports VST2 and VST3 plugins, and in this video, we'll be exploring how to add all of your third-party plugins to Mixcraft. To begin adding your plugins, we'll go up to the top left and select File and Preferences, or use Control, Alt, and P. In the Preferences window, we'll go down to Plugins. Here, you can select Edit VST slash VSTI folders. Your plugin should be loaded in by default, but if you need to add a new directory, you can select Add here and then select the directory on your computer where your VST or VST3 plugins are located. If you'd like, you can also auto-scan for the VST and VSTI directories. This way, you don't have to dig through your computer and Mixcraft can assist you with locating them. Once you've added your plugin directories, you can select OK. If you find that you're missing plugins or you've recently purchased or added a new plugin, you can go to this Preferences window and select Rescan All VST Plugins to run a full scan of all the listed directories in order to find new plugins or remove ones that have been taken out but are still showing in Mixcraft. Once you've set up your plugin directories, you can select OK. Now, if you add an effect or instrument, you should see all of your third-party plugins listed alongside the stock Mixcraft plugins. If you need to manage your plugins by adding or removing them from your plugin directory, you can go up to the top and select File, and then Manage Plugins. The Plugin Manager makes it easy to manage all of your plugins. As you can see in some cases, I have duplicates of a VST and a VST3. Within this window, I can remove these duplicates so that I can find the one I'm looking for. This is a great way to clean up your plugin list, especially if you have quite a few plugins. Another great feature of the Plugin Management window is the Collections tool. Collections are great to manage common processing chains and keep things accessible. Let's try this out by adding some plugins for a vocal chain. To begin, we'll select the plus icon and then name our collection. We'll call this Vocal Chain. To begin adding plugins to our collection, we can go to all of our plugins and find the plugins we'd like to use, like a compressor, and then we can click and drag that over our vocal chain. Now let's find a reverb. and maybe a nice EQ as well. Now, if we take a look at our vocal chain collection, we'll see all of these plugins added here. Once you've finished setting up your collections, you can select OK. From here, as you go to Add Effects, you'll see that your collections are listed at the top, and here we can see our vocal chain with all of the different plugins we've added to it. At this point, you should know how to add your third-party plugins, manage your plugins, and create your own custom plugin collections inside of Mixcraft. And that does it for this video, so thanks for watching.